Hi, what I've got here is the Angle MTV 60F fridge freezer. Nice big fridge freezer, ideal for families to get away. So let's check out the details. Hit it. Right, Kevin from Snowy's Outdoors here. This is the Angle MTV 60 fridge freezer. We're just going to have a closer look at it. We'll start off with the dimensions. Overall, including the handles, the fridge is quite big. It's actually 89 centimetres long. We've got an overall width of 49 centimetres and we've got an overall height of 44.1 centimetres high. Now up this end here, you can obviously see the handles, they are removable, you can take them off and put them on. We've got lots of ventilation around here to let the heat out, and you've got your control panel up on the top here. Around the side here, we've got two nice solid catches used for hooking the loop down. They are lockable, you can actually put a padlock in there to hold them down, so no one pinches your, your fish or your fridge or your beer. Nice big handle here for lifting, and of course when it goes up, you've got a safety chain here that'll stop the fridge lid from going too far over. Nice big fridge, 60 litre capacity altogether, and we've got an overall dimension inside the fridge of 51 centimetres. We've got a width this way of 38 centimetres and a depth from top to bottom of 31 centimetres. We've got a wall thickness of 5 centimetres with a high density polyurethane insulation. The baskets come out quite easily, easy for cleaning, they've got nice reinforcing ribs around the side. And of course we've got a little LED light here that goes on and off as the lid closes and shuts. Now these models are also available as a combi, which means you can get one with a divider in the centre. That will give you a fridge one side and a freezer the other, or it can be all fridge. They're not as tall as some of the other models, you can see that I can easily get a milk bottle in here, uh, but the wine bottle is just a little bit too tall, and for that reason you'd have to lay it down. Let's look at the business end of this fridge. You can see down here that we've got plenty of ventilation for the motor. This has the Sawafuji swing motor, current draws between 0.5 of an amp and 4.2 amps. Just here on the side you've got two plugs, the left hand one is 12 volt, the front right hand one is a 240 volt. Let's grab these leads. You can see the plug goes into here very easily, and of course on the end of the plug there is a fuse in there to protect against shorts. The 240 volt plug goes in exactly the same way. And that allows you to run on mains power. If you look up the top here, we've got the control panel. Very easy to use. You can see I've got a little knob here that I'll turn around. Wait till the fridge to start up. Now if you watch the temperature there, you can see I'm starting to adjust the temperature up and down. And it'll actually go right down to as low as minus 18 degrees Celsius. If you want to turn on the battery protection, you push the mode button twice and it's currently off. Hit the select button, it goes to low. Hit it again, goes to high third time it goes back to off again. Okay, I just want to explain about the battery protection system of this fridge. When you have it set at low, that means it draws more current out of the battery before it'll turn itself off. If you set the setting at high, then it'll draw less current out of the battery before it turns itself off. That means it's better for if you're using, say, a starter motor battery compared to an auxiliary battery. If you don't want to use this sort of system at all, you can switch it off and just monitor the batteries yourself. Now the fridge comes with a really nice smooth gunmetal finish on the outside of the cabinet. Comes in at about 33 kilos in weight and is a great fridge for a group of friends, families and all of your mates to go away on a camping trip. So that's all I can tell you about this fridge. If you want any more information about any other products we have, go to our website on snowy.com.au where you'll find the lowest prices every day. If you've got any questions, you can leave a comment down there. If you like what you see, subscribe up here or if you want to watch some more videos, just have a look over here.